Why do we want it? Why do we want it? As Greta Thunberg said, we have not come here to beg politicians for change. We have come here to show them that change is coming. I'm Sophia Mather, I'm 11 years old, and I'm from Sudbury, Ontario. If adults don't give a damn for my future, why should I? I was Canada's first climate striker because um, uh, I got to Greta pretty early. Um, I watched her YouTube videos and I started to strike in November. You say you love your children above all else, and yet you're stealing their future in front of their very eyes. 15-year-old in Sweden has missed class every Friday since August to sit outside her country's parliament, and she's been calling on others around the world to do the same. Adults keep saying, we owe it to the young people to give them hope. But I don't want your hope. I don't want you to be hopeful. I want you to panic. I want you to feel the fear I feel every day. And then I want you to act. Like, what do you want to do to help others? I just want to be alive in 50 years. Basically. That's good, alive in 50 years. Yeah. Uh, my name is Alec Volkov. I'm from Thornhill, Ontario, and I am 17 years old. I feel like grown-ups don't understand like the necessity of doing strikes like this. I feel like they don't understand how important climate change is as an issue worldwide. And because they keep telling us to study for our futures, but like, what futures? My name is Zoe, I am 12 years old, and I'm from Toronto. Greta Thunberg inspiring me a lot, and um, for a long time I'd wanted to do something big about climate change, but I never knew what, but this seemed like something that I could do. It's important that kids take a lead because we can't vote, and the grown-ups are kind of deciding our future for us, which is not fair. And, and also, people listen to kids. I'm Serafina Sky Shanti Bennett. I am nine years old, and I'm from Toronto, Ontario. A lot of people are like, oh, um, what about the people in the oil industries, and the electronic industries, and the paper industries? Well, it doesn't really matter what job you have if you're dead, so.